Right, here we are, we're back out on the bank for another session. Excuse me if I sound a bit puffed, but I've just ended up pushing all the gear around. Just literally turned up into the swim. So we're on another quick overnight during work. Just coming up 20 past three. I've got to leave at about half past four in the morning to get back to the hellhole. It's the Tuesday after the May bank holiday, so it's the 8th of May today. I don't normally fish bank holidays, so I really try and avoid it if I can. It's just too busy for me, too many anglers, too much pressure. Um, I come fishing to be on my own, get away from people and sort this out. And I can't do that with loads of people around. So decided, give the bank holiday weekend a complete miss, come down on Tuesday, which is today, do a night and uh, see if we can have one. So we're having a little bit of a change of scenery today. We've come down onto the Long Lake. Now I haven't fished this lake for about a year now, I'd say, probably even a little bit longer than that. Last session I did on here, I actually had a really good session, done really well. It was a social with one of my mates. Um, I've dropped into peg 12. Like I say, we're on the Long Lake. I've fished this peg before. I know a couple of areas out in front of me. Um, there's a nice margin spot up against the island here. And the biggest fish that I've had from the lake was right down in this edge, just in front of this tree here, which is a chuck slightly to the left from the swim that I'm in, peg 12. It's an absolutely beautiful day. We've had scorching hot weather all weekend. You'll probably see by my head, I've got a bit burnt over the weekend. Um, it's a lovely day. So I'm gonna get a little bit of gear set up, get some rods out, not put too much bait out, if any. At first, I'm probably just gonna put a couple of little mesh bags out there, see how that does. If I don't get anything this evening, I'll put a few more bait a few more baits out and a little bit of pellet out or something like that and uh, see how the session progresses I've seen a good few fish cruising along sort of a foot under the surface or something like that it's coming up to spawning time so whether they're going to be too interested in feeding I'm not too sure so it might be a case of putting one out on the bottom putting one out on a zig and seeing what happens so here we are we're out we're happy we're fishing welcome to the long lake Good news, bad news. Uh, put the right hand rod out towards the island over there. Just here. Um, it was only out for probably half an hour. Had a bite, ripped off, hooked into it, come away from the island and unfortunately the hook pulled. I'm a little bit wounded about that to be honest. Um, and then I cast it back out. Um, and then I weren't quite happy with it. It was kind of a little bit off the spot. So I thought, right, bring it back in. I brought it back in. Clipped another bag on it, whipped it back out, nice and close to the island, perfect, spot on. Put the rod back on the rest. Literally, it could have been out a minute, not even a minute, and off it went. Um, hooked into it, and we've got something in the net. It's not a carp, it's a tench, but I don't mind tench, I like them. I like tench, so I'm happy, I'm happy. It's, it's put a plaster on the wound, put it that way. So I'm happy about that. Got a little tension in it. I'll get him out, I'll show you. The hardest fighting tension I've caught in a long, long time. Absolutely wouldn't come away from that island. I weren't giving it too much pressure because I just lost one. I was taking it a little bit easy because I'm shitting my pants basically. Um, and I'm trying to pull it away from the island. It's gone round to the front of the island and I just kept that little bit of pressure on it and just come away from the island. So uh, yeah, happy about that. Got to be happy about it. So I'll get the tension out and uh, I'll show you what it looks like. Well, there we are, that was a nice tench. Well happy about that. That's removed the salt from the wound, let's put it that way. As soon as I got that fish in, I literally got it in the net, nice and safe, took it out, put it on the mat, unhooked it, put the fish back into the net, just left in there for a minute. Um, didn't have to rebake the hook because I'm using double plastic corn on that rod. Uh, literally just dipped it in a, um, a bit of flavoring, 
hooked another little mesh bag on there and pinged it straight back out on the spot and got that straight back out there. And then I got the fish out, dealt with it and uh, put it back, released him nice and safe, catch and release. Um, so yeah, well chuffed. So the rod's back out on the spot. Hopefully it goes again and this time it's a carp. Just coming up nine o'clock now. Uh, it's time for me to get my head down, <clears throat> get a bit of kit before I have to head off to work in the morning. Uh, I've not had anything else from that um, since the last fish, uh, that tench. Um, lovely fish that was. Uh, I've repositioned the left hand rod. I'm literally just down in front of this tree here. There's been a fish crash in front of this bush here. Uh, I've seen it twice probably in the last hour or so. I have had a bait on it for about half an hour. So I'm going to fish that on the left hand rod tonight. Right hand rod's out towards the island where I lost the one earlier unfortunately and I caught the tench from. What I did just up against that island is I put a couple of little mini spawns of the corn, the red halibut pellet and a few crushed up baits in there as well uh, and boilies and uh, put about four or five mini spawns over the top of that so not a lot of bait just literally a little bit of attraction in the area to hopefully draw the fish back in. I think I spooked them off when I lost that one or had that tent earlier. So, <clears throat> update will be in the morning in the car, I'm sure, on the way out the gate as I'm heading off back to the hellhole. Thanks very much for watching, and I'll catch you in the morning. <laughs>